Hey my lovelies, a blessed to you all and welcome back to my channel. Thank you for always stopping by. I really appreciate you. And if today is your very first time coming across this channel, you are most welcome. My name is Happiness. And so in today's video, I want to share with you the secret of getting this plantain recipe perfect. So please keep watching. So this is all I need to get this recipe done. I'll be needing two green plantains. I'll also need some salt to taste. I'll also need some vegetable oil. Feel free to use any vegetable oil of your choice. I'll also need a wooden ladle. This will enable you to press the plantains. So let's get started my plantain is washed already all i'm going to do now is to peel off the skin So I'm going to cut each plantain into three. So I am done. I'm going to give it one more rinse and then we'll come back to it. So all I'm going to do is sprinkle some salt, give it a quick mix and then fry it on my already heating oil. So you want to do this on a medium low. The reason is if you do this on a high heat, it's going to burn before you achieve that first um, stage, which is really, really important. So you want to make sure you do this on a medium low. So after about five minutes, this is what it looks like. So if you do this on a high heat, you won't even get up to five minutes. Your planting will start burning. So this is the first step, the very first step of getting a perfect fried plantains. So at this point, this is ready. As you can see, it's not burnt. It's just golden brown, which is what you are aiming at so at this point i'm going to take it out and let it sit for about a minute or two before we go into the next step so you can see how beautiful this looks already but this is about 50 percent fried so um, we're going to go into the next stage to get it to that perfect um, fried state which is the pressing method so while doing this process you want to make sure it is not too thin or too thick that way it gets fry um, evenly quickly without burning yet properly fried does that make sense So as you can see, um, we have um, successfully pressed these plantains properly the way it should. So the next step is to fry it now. I'm also frying this on a medium low. That is because you want it to fry evenly and properly. Okay, so avoid whenever you're doing this, avoid the high heat. You don't need a high heat at all. So all you need is a medium heat to get this to achieve this um, perfectly. You guys, look at how beautiful this looks already. And it's crunchy, like I tell you. This is a great snack, honestly. So I'm going to repeat the same process until we are done. Hey, have you watched to this point? Thank you so much. I really appreciate your time. Please take our time to give this video a thumbs up. And when you do so, please leave me your comments in the comment section below. Thank you. And if you're not yet a part of this family, you are most welcome. All you need to do is to smash on that subscribe button and turn on the bell icon so you get notified whenever I drop another content. 
Thank you so much and God bless you. You guys, can you see our snack? This is ready. Like you can have it like that. As you can see, I had it with some peppered sauce and it came out so the combo was something else. And these kids did not even allow this plantain to get down. Like everyone rushed it. That is how good it was. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you all. And always remember... If you can imagine it, believe in it, then you can achieve it. Until I come your way again, stay safe and stay blessed. And always know that I love you. Bye.